welcome 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 to my youtube channel this is info hub if you are a returning subscriber thank you for the love if this is the first time coming across my youtube channel i still want to tell you thank you i bring in information that can help you move abroad to study work and even settle so if these are the kind of informations you like then please hop on and join the, the family by subscribing to this youtube channel and also do not forget to turn on the notification bell so when i release videos like these you may just be the first to be notified today's video takes us to north america canada we're going to talk about how you can move to canada on a direct permanent residency so we are going to talk about one of the best ways to move to canada on direct permanent residency which is the canadian express entry system now the canadian express entry system is a popular immigration program that allows skilled workers to migrate to canada based on their education work experience their language proficiency and other factors this program was introduced in 2015 and has become one of the most popular pathways to Canadian permanent residency ever since. This express entry system manages the pool of candidates who have applied for permanent residency through one of the three programs, the Federal Skilled Worker Program, the Federal Skilled Trades Program, and the Canadian Express Experience Class. So which means before you are selected on this express entry system, you must have applied for a visa or a program, which is the Federal Skilled Worker Program, Federal Skilled Trades Program, and Canadian Experience Class. So candidates are ranked based on their comprehensive ranking system, which is called CROS score, which takes into account factors such as age, education, language proficiency, work experience, and other factors which means you gain points based on your age, your education, your language proficiency, work experience, and many other factors too. So the highest points get nominated. So the CRS score is calculated out of a possible 1,200 points. So there are 1,200 points there to get, and you use those factors mentioned before to get those points. With over 600 points out of that 1,200 available for human capital. When we mean human capital, we're talking about factors like education, work experience, and language proficiency. Then an additional 600 points are also available for candidates. And this one is not on human capital, but on factors such as if the candidate already has a job in Canada, which means he has a Canadian employer, or if the candidate has a nomination from a Canadian province or territory. So let's talk about the eligibility. So to be eligible for the express entry system, candidates must meet the following requirements. First requirement, the candidates must be eligible for these three visas or programs, the Federal Skilled Worker Program, the Federal Skilled Trades Program, or the Canadian Experience class. In the description box below, I will leave the criteria for you to be eligible for these three programs, the links there and more about them so you can check them out. The second requirement is the candidates must have at least one year of skilled work experience in a national occupation classification, which means the candidate must have a skill in a Canadian in the Canadian shortage occupation list. So you might want to check it out and see if you have experience, at least one experience in those skills there. Then also the candidates must meet the language requirements for the program they are applying to. So the, this, those programs, those three programs mentioned above, they all have their specific language requirements and you must meet them. That is another criteria. Then the other criteria is the candidates must have sufficient funds to support themselves and their family in Canada. Proof of funds, yes, you must have proof of funds. Then the candidate must pass a medical exam and security background check. Thus, those are some of the eligibility. Then the candidates who meet the requirements or this eligibility I just mentioned, they will have to create an express entry profile 
and then they will enter the pool of candidates now they'll be ranked based on their CRA score so which means some people may have higher scores than others the higher scores will receive an invitation to apply ITA on the Australian visa Australia permanent residency I also talked about ITA so when you receive this ITA to apply for permanent residency you you now have to apply 60 days after you receive your ITA so if you receive your ITA today in the next 60 days you can apply but after that it gets expired so the application process will take within six months and if approved the candidates and their family members can now move to canada as permanent residency so that is really really amazing so in summary of what we've been saying since the canadian express entry system is a competitive program that allows skilled workers to migrate to Canada based on their qualifications and other factors. Candidates must meet the eligibility requirements and have met the and have a high CRS score to be selected for permanent residency. So if you are considering migrating to Canada, the express entry system might just be a very good option for you because it is cheaper than the study routes even though it takes longer time but it's still very cheaper and it's direct permanent residency unlike study visa that is not direct permanent residency so this is where we come to the end of this video if you have any question please and please drop it down in the comment section below and also the links to where you can check more information on this will be on the description box and the links to other things i mentioned will be down in the description box below so if you find this video helpful do not forget to like this video so youtube can recommend it to others and also to show your appreciation for this amazing video join the youtube family by subscribing to this youtube channel and also turn on the notification bell so when i release videos like these you may just be the first to be notified thank you